So this is still a work in progress. It's a new enclosure I'm working on. This is how my brain works. It's kind of screwed up. So you see how I got this wire mesh? It's like a quarter inch wire mesh. Everything, there's this one here that goes under the uh, bed of cork bark and comes back out and around and sits about where that paint can is. Everything from this side over should be dry land. This piece here is going to be a bridge that'll go over to another bit of dry land that'll actually be, this is all going to be a hide. This area here and the area in the back is going to enclose the majority of this section here. There's going to be a little open area here to help me clean it out if I ever needed to. And still allow a little bit of light so I can kind of peek in there and see without having a big tunnel covering it all up. And that'll be a hide. The, this area here is arcs out and comes around and goes into the back. And that whole area will be the land mass for that hide. And with the way this waterfall still drips, their drips are going to come down this log, land into what will be water area down here in between the two land masses to make a giant pond for them. And same with where it still leaks behind this area here where the roof of the hide is going to be. All that, it'll still be allowed to drip there and it'll just come down behind the landmass and into the pond. Plus the water where it's supposed to run when it comes down here, out of the hose, it'll drip down these two areas up here. One will come down here. The other hopefully will run down this, this seam in the back and then come down. And then it'll help water this plant down here. So I, I got to put something that's really um, favorable of extra moisture in there. There's going to be a plant here, a plant here, um, possibly like an orchid or something growing out of there. This is going to be a hide when it's all done. I got to finish that up. The water's going to come down here, come around the corner, come down this little area here, which is going to be the main waterfall, into the uh, water area. And that's actually this wire mesh is how I used to mock up this whole waterfall and backing area is with the wire mesh and the uh, enclosure on its back. I mocked it all up with cardboard, then I mocked it all up with the wire mesh and used zip ties that I still have to cut out in some spots to hold it all together until I could spray foam it all in until I got to this point where it's officially standing up. And I'm starting to color in parts of it and figure out exactly what I'm going to do as we go through and finish it up. And yes, I'm going to fill this in with some moss. So Mr. Bones here will, uh, maybe I'll put a, I don't know, you tell me, some kind of vine of some sort growing out of his mouth. That would look pretty cool. Alright. Peace. Mr. Bones is also going to get, I'm going to put a glowing skull in there and a glowing skull in there so at night he'll have glowing skull eyes in the skull. Yeah, don't ask. <laughs>